A few days ago, we marked the 12th anniversary of taking care of dreamers as, that President Obama and I put in place. There are a few of these immigrant of these immigration areas that have had most positive area impact and gotten more support from the American people across the board. So today I'm announcing new measures to clarify and speed up work visas to help people, including dreamers, who have graduated from U.S. colleges and universities, landed jobs in high-demand, high-skilled professions that we need to have grow to see our economy grow. It's the right thing to do. The second action I'm announcing today is about keeping families together. My dad used to have an expression. He said, Joey, family's about the beginning, middle, and the end, about keeping couples together who are married, where one spouse is a U.S. citizen, the other is undocumented. They've been living in the United States for at least 10 years. These couples have been raising families, sending their kids to church and school, paying taxes, contributing to our country for every — for 10 years or more. Matter of fact, the average time they've spent here is 23 years, the people we're affecting today. But living in the United States all this time, with this fear and uncertainty, we can fix that. And that's what I'm going to do today. Fix it. Entendí, eh que mi vida es aquí, que toda mi vida literal está acá. Entonces, soy dueña de mi propio negocio, um, creo empleos para personas, pago mis impuestos, eh, casada con, con un ciudadano americano y tenemos una familia hermosa de cinco hijas. If Biden is not re-elect, it's really scary. Just to think about it, I, I get really scared because I don't know if then the new president will take everything away from us and we'll end up, I will end up in Mexico.